Let's start. Today we will see how to implement a radio button alert dialog in Flutter Android. Let's see the main.dart file. First, we import the material.dart package. Then, we create the stateless widget called myApp in the main function. This is the myApp stateless widget. We create a material app and apply a theme in the build function. The home attribute is set to a stateful widget called my home page. This is the my home page stateful widget. Here we create a state object of this stateful widget, whose name is underscore my home page state. This is an enum, which we will use to hold the radio buttons. This is underscore my home page state class, here we will design our app. In the build function, we have a scaffold widget upon which we will build other widgets. The app bar attribute is set to the app bar widget. We have used the title variable as the title of this app bar. The body attribute is set to the center widget. Inside that, we have an elevated button. When the button is clicked, we call the show alert dialog function. This is the show alert dialog function. Here we will design the alert dialog. We will show two radio buttons, A and B. By default radio button A is selected. This is how we design the alert dialog. In a column widget, we will create three row widgets to design three radio buttons. Here we use the row widget. Inside that, we place a radio button and a text widget. Similarly, this is the second radio button design. Finally, we design two buttons on the alert dialog, which are the cancel button and the OK button. This is how we create the cancel button. And this is how we create the OK button. When these buttons are clicked, we close the alert dialog. Let's run the app. So that's it. That's how you can create a radio button alert dialog in Flutter Android. Thank you.